Hello and welcome to another update video about Phantom. I think Phantom, um, if, if we get some kind of a pullback from here, we'll have a very favorable rewards to risk ratio. Um, I'm still looking at the support area down there. Maybe we get back into it. Um, at the moment, it's consolidating pretty much at a high level though, but it's below resistance. So we still have to keep the option open that this is an ABC correction within wave two, that wave two will actually end here. Um, from a support point of view, it doesn't really matter. I mean, we had a successful trend reversal area here, basically pullback area for a long trade that so far worked out. What I cannot rule out at this stage is that we hit this support area again. That would then be another opportunity for a pullback trade. Note that um, we don't need to go down that far. Yeah, It depends on what kind of structure is evolving here. But in terms of um, possible pullback areas, I think sort of between 40 cents and 34.3, um, very favorable reward to risk ratio. There is currently a question if we've had a one, two setup here and we're already in the third wave or if we're still in the wave two. Yeah, there are different options, um, but it, it remains my view as long as we hold the 34 cent level. Yeah, I mean, it's 34.3 here, but you know, let, let's choose the, the round number 34 cents. As long as we're holding that, um, this sort of one, two setup is valid. We could make a case for counting this as a wave one. It wouldn't change the support area much. I wouldn't I wouldn't worry about it because there is some certainty on the lower time frame which of these setups is going to work out. But the trend is clearly up. You know, we had um we had a nice five up. We have bullish implications because we broke above the trend channel. Um so yeah, that's the setup that I gave you in the last few weeks here. Um and the last week actually, the small one, worked out nicely. Um and we're now in resistance. If we break directly above 52.6, we could get an escalation, a direct breakout in a third wave. Target for that would be... So we talk about 67 cents for the third wave, yeah. But if we get a pullback into the yellow area, it's a very, very favorable reward to risk ratio, again, in my opinion. Um, but yeah, for now we're holding above the trend channel, so I wouldn't rule out a direct breakout, but you can see how nicely it's reacting. Um, to the Fibonacci resistance. So consolidating on a pretty high level and any break above 52.6 would increase the likelihood of a direct move to 67. There is some support, there were resistance at the B wave high at um, basically 60 cents and then at 65 cents, the previous high here of the uh, 3rd of Feb. So yeah, um, it's, it's not the best sort of chart in terms of structure to the upside, but it's all right, tradable, you know, um, in a possible five wave move up within this blue C wave. Okay, that's my update about uh, Phantom. I hope you liked the update. If you did, please hit the like button, leave a comment and subscribe. And if you really like the content, then please check out the channel membership. Thanks a lot for watching. Bye-bye.